Hey guys, uh, welcome back to career mode and it is episode number 11, yeah we're into them double figures which is really nice and basically this episode we have got a big fixture lined up so basically as you know we're going quite far into the cup, sorry if you heard that music there, we're going quite far into the cup so basically we're gonna, we've are we got to play Chelsea, <laughs> um, it's going to be a huge fixture, I was just checking through my squad because there's a few kind of players that look quite unfit. I mean, Padding Courts for starters. So I'm tempted not to play him and maybe give Jake Foster Casky a run about in that centre attacking mid role. Also, um, one thing I was just going to say is thanks for the support on these episodes. I've have hit 120 subs now, so you know it's 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 really good, really. You know because and I've got you know I've got some fans. I call them fans. Um, and I've got a couple of shout outs to do from the episode. Just checking them over now. Right, so basically I want to say Christopher Whale wants me to bring Christopher Whale. Yeah, there you go. He wants me to bring that Kazenga Lawala Wild, which I may try and do. That would be pretty cool. I think he's gone to Oh, he's gone to I think he's gone to Reading or something. He's actually playing quite well there. Um also there was a recommendation from Ryan Lang. He's recommended to me that I should actually put Int at centre back, which I think is quite a cool idea because he's I mean, he's got decent defending stats, uh, if you have a look at his card. If I got him on the team. But the trouble is, he is one of my main midfielders currently. He has got high strength. And he can play centre-back. So I actually quite like the idea of that. So I'm actually going to play him ahead of Greer. I know that may seem stupid because Greer is a big player for us. But I don't know. I feel I feel that could be a cool idea. Thanks for that recommendation. I didn't realise that on his card it said he could play centre-back. So I think that, yeah, that is a perfect idea. Thanks for recommendations. Keep on recommending me ideas because it keeps you know it keeps this series going. It keeps me bringing in new ideas. I'm going to put Teixeira in and then Calderon's my captain. There you go. Right, so we're going to this game versus Chelsea. Right, we're going into this game versus Chelsea. And yeah, really, thanks for that idea. I like that idea of instant centre back because with his pace, he could and his strength and his height, he could develop into a really really good centre back. So yeah, Jesus Christ, that's hard. Right, let's go. Come on, guys. Diego Costa is playing. Mark Schwarzer, Ivanovic, Cahill, Zuma, Felipe Luiz. That's a solid team. Mikel, actually, it's quite similar to the team they played in the cup recently. Again, was it Shrewsbury? He's got Davila and Costa. He's also got Scherler. So he's got Scherler and Costa playing, so he's got some big threats in that team. Oh, a very, very solid Chelsea team. Uh, not very well. Not very well at all. They've already scored. Well, oh dear. Davila, whoever he is, is. Oh my god, my defence just opened up. Which involves pretty much the. Oh, go on! Oh, we should have scored! <laughs> we are going to get played about the park this game, but we just have to take our chances. Alright, come on, Kalunga, your first touch is divine. I know it is. Look at that. That is good. Oh, we're getting crowded. Oh, that's a foul, ref! Ref, we'll take the free kick. That's got to be more than a yellow. That's got to be a yellow card at least. I thought that'd be a red. Absolute rubbish chance. Is Holler, Holler is playing. This is a big chance from the free kick here. This is a huge chance. But oh, I don't know. If I try and whip it in. That's too weak. Oh, it's a great free kick. Yes, we scored. <laughs> what a free kick! I thought I underpowered it. I didn't, and it's gone in top right corner. What a goal! Brilliant goal there from Holler. Look at this. Whips it into that corner. He's got lots of power and decent bit of curve, and that is probably one of the best goals of the series. Holler is a well, not a goal machine, but the goals he does, he, he scores are just of the top draw. Brilliant goal from Holler. One 0 versus Chelsea. Oh, tackle! Go, send him through. Where's his defence con? Kalunga, goal! It's two one. The hell, Chelsea's defence is awful. Oh my lord, what, what, what has happened to their defence? This is amazing. We're beating Chelsea at Stamford Bridge. I don't understand this. This is really confusing. This is set on world class with Chelsea, and we're beating them. Do you ever believe this? I'm shocked. Over the top, Teixeira. Oh my god! I can't explain this! I can't explain this! 
Quip it and Chelsea at the bridge. Oh my god, what a strike! How are we doing this? Oh my god. I can't believe this. Jesus. This is amazing. How how in the world are we beating Chelsea? I, I don't have a clue. Anyway guys, that was a very, very good half. I mean we're I'm very, very good. That was best performance we've had all series. And only the only team we do it against is Chelsea in the cup. It's amazing. Oh my god, Kalunga! Kalunga! Chip him! Oh, that was too cheeky. Oh my god, Brighton are amazing. Oh! Stockdale. Please. No. No! Oh, that's a goal. Oh, he scored. No. Ah, I told you. Our defence can open up and Diego Costa's not going to miss from there. No. Oh, no. No, good save. What a save, Stockdale. Oh, my God. Update squad. So, Torres, yes, he does still play for Chelsea. Oh, no. No. Oh, no. Our defence is just like, oh, for God's sake. We had a two-goal lead. Oh, O'Grady, O'Grady, oh, finish it, come on, oh, Otoko, O'Grady, 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 oh my god, Chris O'Grady is just dreadful at finishing, just like in real life, <laughs> with energy you can. Right, that was a good, that one, that was an amazing performance, I mean to keep Chelsea to a draw it means we go into extra time though. See how we do for now, and then, yeah. Go for a chip. Go for a cheeky chip. Oh! <laughs> I, oh, no. Oh, he's done too much. Torres has done too much, surely. <laughs> okay, come on. One more half to hold out. Come on. Or score. Please score. That would be absolutely unbelievable. Oh no. Good save. <laughs> Come on. It's going down to penalties. This is it, look, that's we we've managed I don't know how we drew that, but we did. And now it comes down. Two penalties. I wanna check over my penalty takers. Obviously want the best. First. Oh, come on. Come on, make yourself look big, make yourself look big, make yourself look big. He's going left, he's going left. Oh my. Might get injured during the three. I'll say, yes! Get in! Oh! Oh shit, 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 keep it down. No! Please. Oh, they're all going left and they're all. Oh, he saved it again! Oh no! No. For God's oh, we had a three-one lead. We threw it away. We played really, really well, but ah. Oh. The penalties of Chelsea, I told you they'd be classed and they're all per- I wouldn't have saved one of them. And some of ours were just wrong, I mean, we don't have the quality that they have and fair enough to Chelsea, they destroyed us on the penalty shootout. Anyway, we've got a nice easy game next, I think I might play a few of the off players against Rotherham. Someone's returning from injury. Sam Bulldog's back, very nice. Actually, I don't think I will. I won't change up the formation. I'm, I need to give a few different players a run about, so... I might give... No. Yeah, I'm going to give Agustine a go in midfield. How old is Greer? 33. I'll, I'll give... You know, I'm going to give Agustine a run about. I haven't played him at all this series, so... I'm going to give him a quarter go at centre attack in mid. I think... Yeah, I'll give Bruno a go right back as well. I think that's how I run with the team. Yeah. 
Cool. Right, let's go. Hmm. Okay, here we go. Freestyle Fable through. That's not offside. You're having a laugh. If that's offside. There you go. There's a goal. <laughs> that's that's very overpowered on our ultimate team. Just taking it round the keeper. Easily past the keeper and into the corner. Well, into the back of the open net. Easy. 17th goal of the season for Mikhail Smith, which is really nice because it's obviously we want Mikhail Smith scoring lots of goals, and that's what he did there. But probably change his role. Oh no, that's a goal. No! <laughs> Rotherham have scored! We're being a bit like today's goal at the back and we've allowed them to score. Oh, that, that's, that's not good, that's not good. Come on, Kalunga. Go on, Kalunga, all the way. All the way. All the way. All the way. That's a penalty. What is this defender doing there? That should be a red card, bruh. Dragging me down in the box like that. Kalunga! Goal. There we go, his goal he guessed the wrong way. Nice goal. Ooh, well, he made it. He won the penalty. He scored the penalty. <laughs> Pretty simple. Then it would be a different, definite injury. But yeah, the, the, yeah, that was a decent half. But I think Carlos Smith picked up a knock. Hopefully, it'll be okay. I think he'll run it off. But yeah, hopefully, it's nothing too serious because Carlos Smith's basically my main striker. He's the one who's scoring all the goals. Good bit of defending there. Yeah. Okay. Wait. No, I don't know. He's still injured. Oh, that's a, such a good goal. Oh, thank God. <laughs> it's a great finish. I was just worried because he got wiped out by the keeper with an injury. But he finishes with an in injury. So I think he's fine. But yeah, lovely one-twos from Mikhail Smith and Paddy McCourt. He just slots it under the keeper there. When he got wiped out, I was just worried. I think he'll be fine. Um... I think he'll be okay. Uh, Paul is looking pretty tired. Maybe we should give Petoko a CDM. Also, I want to give Solly March another runabout. Actually, hey, off right. That would have been such a good, such a good move. Oh no! Oh dear! I tell you what, our defense is quite weak at times. Oh my God! Mikel Smith has still got the injury symbol name. I might have to bring him off. I'm going to take Mikael Smith off, otherwise he's going to pick up a serious knock. I'm going to bring on Teixeira and then actually put Marsh up front. Marsh, March, sorry. Everybody have a great weekend. Uh, go Phils, go O's next week. And uh, on if you have time, point. go to .com -E Oh, that's a good bull. Kalunga, 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 Kalunga! Oh, what a save! All time, 3-2 versus Rotherham there. Do you want us? We're a bit worried at points there. I mean, we had a comfortable 3-1 lead and then we threw it away. Well, not throw it away, but gave away a goal. And that, that kind of put us in a dangerous situation. But it is good because we have won the game in the end. We defended it all right. But attackingly, we were really good. So, yeah, I'm happy with that performance. I know after losing to Chelsea, which is quite gutting, but we did play well in that. It's good to get a win straight after. So, yeah, that was good. Oh, we got some scouting updates, there's so something to look at. Right, so how long is Craig McHale Smith out for? Ah, that's not good, because... I mean, it's three weeks, which isn't too bad, but it is three weeks, Mikhail Smith, who's very important to us. But, okay, yeah, I understand that, Jackson, actually. You know what? I'm going to give. I've got a new idea, because you know I haven't got my young fullback anymore, because... Um, Solly's injured. I'm actually going to bring in Chickson at right back. It's a different idea, but it might work. Agustin was rubbish. <laughs> what? Well, I'm not going to beat around the bush. He was rubbish. Who should I go to centre mid? Stevens? Gardner's quite young, but he's on loan. I'll give Gardner a go. But, uh, he's gone. He was pretty rad average. Have we got anything special? All I see is 94 acceleration there, but nothing good. He's top by seven goals. I doubt Redmond's going to get seven goals in three three or four games. I highly doubt that. But you never know. Hopefully he doesn't. But yeah, that's the reason I wanted to look at it. Because basically, Mikhail Smith's out for three weeks, which is going to be three or four games, maybe five. I don't think Redmond can catch up in that time. Um, 
Bulldog's actually not fully fit still, so... You know what? Vernon Lond. He's a right mid. What's he got? What's he got finishing wise? 65! Screw it, we're playing Fenelon up top. That is that is a brave, brave move. But I think that's how I'm going to top the episode. So Fenelon, someone suggested that we play Fenelon. I was thinking about putting him out on loan, but you know what? I'm going to play Fenelon up front with Kalunga against Car Cardiff as well. That's a big game. So I'd like to say thanks for watching this episode, episode 11. Keep up the brilliant support, keep liking my videos, keep commenting, keep suggesting things, and subscribe if you're new to my channel. And yeah, it's been Smudger XD, and I'm out. Freestyle Friday number nine. Uh, it is April 2nd. Everybody have a great weekend.